So this sister came to Thompson. Look, all these gliders out here. This is Thompson Square Park in Manhattan. All these gliders, man. This is like the cast of Friends, man. You have, Press one if you remember that show Friends back in the 90s. This is like the real life version of Friends. These people that be going down here to this park. Just hanging out, having a good time. Because you know, white people can go to a park a hundred white people can go to a park and hang out all day, and when they gone, you ain't gonna know they was there, man. <laughs> you ain't even gonna know they was there. Some folk, man, ten of us go to a park, man. You gonna think a goddamn tornado came through that motherfucker? So they hanging out at this park, man, and this um, this sister came over there and um kind of pooped on their party man i've been to there man we got a park in dc malcolm x park now that this now that that area is kind of gentrified up there there's a lot of white people hang out at that park and they just sit i'm talking about like if you walk past that park you wouldn't even know anybody was up there because it's, it's elevated right it's, you gotta walk up some steps you go up there and you'd be like fucking 100 white, white people just sitting around in the park Sitting on their asses and shit, or laying on a blanket, playing hacky sack and shit, or fucking um charades or some shit, beating drums and shit. You know they gonna have a drum circle. Just as calm as can be, man. Oh. That one sister came over there and disturbed all the peace, man. And look at these white people, man. Y'all let one sister come over there, man. <laughs> what y'all gonna do if a, if a group of sun being sun teens come over there, man? Y'all can't even handle one sister, man. Gliders know they bet gliders knew they couldn't do that to her though. <laughs> Them gliders, man, they knew. They was like, they was like, please go away. That was <laughs> look at the glider, man. They like, please go away, man. I'm trying to keep my job. Damn, she went for <laughs> Listen, man, I promise you, and I'm not even trying to act like Billy Badass when I say this. I promise you. I mean, I promise. I give you a promissory note. If that was me sitting there, she wouldn't have did that shit. <laughs> I promise you. I promise you. If that was me sitting with this white guy who was reading the paper at, I promise you she wouldn't have came over there and ripped that paper off my hand. I promise you. Wait, 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 
man just sitting there. There's no litter on the ground. They not making a whole bunch of noise. They just sitting there quietly, peacefully. She come out there fucking with them, man. Leave these people alone, man. Rampaging through the town, man, like King Kong. <laughs> King Kong in a red dress, man, in a goddamn bonnet. In a red dress and a red bandana, man. Just rampaging through the town. And none, and, 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 hey, listen, them white people know press one. Them white people seeing uh, City Bike Karen and, um, and, and Daniel Perry. <laughs> City Mike Karen and Daniel Perry, the white people know they can't touch her, man. <laughs> yo, she could, yo, them white people have been trained. We trained y'all quick, man, the last month, was that the last month or last two months between um Daniel Penny and, and City Mike Karen? Clouders is like, yo, I got bills, man. <laughs> All these guys like, yeah, man, I would, I would, I would, I wish, you, I wish I could tackle her and stop her from destroying all our shit, man. Cause now it look like black people shit. This how she, she making, she making the white people's areas look like black people areas, man. <laughs> Look, these people all these people all fucking happy and shit chilling man. Now there's a bunch of fucking fear in the air. These people right here, they was just chilling. Now there's a bunch of fear in the air. <laughs> fucking angst and confusion. <laughs> she just spreading goddamn confusion and cantankerousness and destruction everywhere she goes. <laughs> And the white people powerless, man. They know. That shows you how quick you can, how quick you can shift the narrative. Them white people know. You don't hear no white women screaming. When she grabbed that white woman by her hair, that white woman ain't scream. When she, when she, when she grabbed this white woman by her hair. Right here, that white woman didn't scream. That white woman know. She knows. She's been told. Man, your white tears, man, to get a black man lynched, man. Your white tears is the main ingredient in lynching, man. It's like Kool-Aid. You know how Kool-Aid is the main ingredient in Kool-Aid? White woman tears is the main ingredient in lynchings. That white woman knew she couldn't scream. That white woman was just like, <laughs> this man, these men out here, they knew they couldn't grab that woman, man. They knew they couldn't do nothing. We got carte blanche out this bitch, man. <laughs> Oh shit. Yo. And I was in New York. I was in Harlem, yeah. And I and I went to I went to a restaurant in Manhattan. It's this restaurant in Manhattan. I can't think of the name of it, but they sell they sell pickles. Pickles with everything. So like you get fries and you get big fries, but it's like a regular restaurant, got nice dishes, but 
like their theme is like pickles and they got outdoor eating kind of like this they had an outdoor eating place like this it's a lot of outdoor eating in manhattan man whole lot of outdoor eating in manhattan man and nothing in this in these white people are different man they just civil man <laughs> White people civil, man. That's why, that's why, that's why I'm telling y'all, man. Y'all the only ones that can fix this shit, man. We can't fix it, man. We we not civilized, man. Yeah, she making them look more like her. Ass. She, 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 she want to be more comfortable, so she gotta, she gotta make this like her area, right? She just, she like a bird building a nest, man. This is just nesting, man. The sister's nesting. This sister ain't doing nothing but nesting. <laughs> And look, she even know the deal, man. She ain't resisting. She ain't resisting. She been arrested a bunch of times, man. How many times you think this sister been arrested? Chat, how many times you think this sister been arrested in her life, man? She looked like she about 40, maybe 35, 40, somewhere in between there. Hard to tell, man. She got hard to tell her real age. I would say 40. Look at goddamn Jennifer Aniston right here, man. Yeah, I would think she's been arrested probably like 50 times, man. That type of behavior right there, man. She was so comfortable. Like, she was so comfortable doing that shit, man. I would say she's probably been arrested about 50 times, man. And she know the deal, man. She knew the deal, man. Salute to the sister, man. She knew the deal. <laughs> that white woman don't know how lucky she was yo this white woman don't know how lucky she was if them police wasn't there she was about to be food. yo and this white woman probably hates the fucking police i bet you go on this white woman's fucking um social media she probably she does is talk shit about black bodies and disenfranchised and um, over policing and police brutality. That's probably all this fucking white chick talks about, man. Salute to Jimmy IV, man. Yeah, she got some stems on her, there's no doubt. Yeah, she do need a hamburger. Facts. She, listen, man. This woman crossed paths. Yo. This was, she was so close. Because you know that fucking sister would have seen this tall-ass white woman. You know that sister would attack her. What, what do y'all think the percentage is that is if the cops didn't show up right that moment that this sister would have attacked this white woman? What do you think the odds are, man? <laughs> What's the odds, man? <laughs> yeah, this well at least this 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 fucking white woman doesn't have on a fucking mask. Yeah, I would say about it was a ninety-two percent chance. Cause you got this other guy right here, so she might have fucked with him and got distracted by him. Zero, 
Yeah, she could have. I don't know if she would have let her pass though. That was this sweet. She's sweet, man. This is this this is rec this recreation right here for her, man. This would have been rap. She needs to run to their house. Yeah, we'll figure that out. Yes. No more. You know, you need to stay in the house. Don't go around beating up strange people. In Look, she, he, the guy says she needs to stay in jail. <laughs> Listen to her. Yeah, but it's not the cops that determine that. It's gonna be Alvin Bragg or Melvin Bragg, whatever the fuck his name is. It's gonna be Al Alvin Bragg is the one that's gonna determine whether she gets out, not these cops. Beating up strange people in the street, like seven people. Pulling their hair, dragging them everywhere. Thank you. So officer, don't just yeah, 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 yeah. ever know that we're a no snitch policy, man. <laughs> hey man, somebody get somebody get this brother, man. Tell him about the no snitch policy in the black community, man. If y'all know him, anybody in Manhattan, man, I need y'all to go tell his brother, man. Get his brother a message for me, man. Um you know there's no snitching, right? Yeah, we got to be out of money for all of us. Yeah, I was Man, put one of them bags over her head. They crazy as shit. I'd have put a spit bag over her fucking head. And, and, and some goddamn fucking goddamn black person would be like, they putting the bag over her head. Yeah, some random black person would have walked up and not know what the fuck was going on. Just, man, they try to kill her. She can't breathe, man. Let her go, y'all. Look, y'all. Look, y'all. Hey, everybody. I'm live on Facebook, man. They out here trying to kill this black woman. She ain't here do nothing. I'd have put a spit bag over. I'd have put any bag. I'd have put a plastic bag over. As soon as she would have spit, I'd have put a plastic bag over her fucking head. Look at these, look at these, look at these tigers sitting here all civil. Look how civil they are. They can just sit there and eat. Ain't loud. Ain't all fucking to hey damn y'all this dude look listen. all loud and making a scene and shit. They don't even give a fuck about this shit going on behind them. 